their way into the dock. Every game critical in the postseason. This one no different, and we are underway. And that's hooked away. Taken along the wall by Kipper. And now it's grabbed by Nelson. Takes it to the net. Tremendous stop by Talbot. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. We're still scoreless. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Grabbed along the board by Kopitar. Down the left wing, across into the offensive end. Poked away in the defensive end. Takes a spill onto the ice and loses the puck. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. And that's picked up by Kopitar. And he'll regroup deep inside the defensive zone with the puck. Stopped by the goaltender. And they'll get a breather as the goaltender covers it up. Dowdy's been working so hard with the puck and without it. It's just not dropping for him. And when it doesn't drop, it can be extremely frustrating. You want to get points. You want to feel like you're contributing. LA's got the win off that draw. Gains the zone through the middle. Quick feed to Moore. And that's blocked in traffic. Can't hang on to the puck after taking a knock. And a smart heads up play with the bank. Tries to dangle and the puck skips away. He is so dangerous when the puck is on his stick in the offensive zone, but he tries one too many moves and he loses the puck. Moves it to Paltier. Gives him nothing in front. Slides the puck over. Horvat's got it in the offensive zone. He says, let's get physical on that play. Directed over to Moore. Here's a short pass to Highfield. Sorry for jumping in, James, but that was a massive hit. Takes the feed. Los Angeles has it in the open ice. Slides the puck ahead into the neutral zone. Great reach with the poke check. The Islanders scoop it up along the boards. He got all of that hit. Puck grab by Gavrikov. Quick pass to Ava. Oh, what a save! Uh, that doesn't swing momentum in your favor. I don't know what will, James. That's a last-ditch effort to make a play. What a beautiful save. Sends the feet in front. Shot! New York's got it in their own zone. Picked up along the boards by Engvall. Moves it quickly over to Kellyev. Spence his stick breaks and he's logged it back to the bench and gets a new one. Now he gets back into the play quickly. From the point, looks to make something happen. Takes a bump and hangs on. And he scores! Yes! Yes! Yes, they're on their feet here tonight! Well, your coach is preaching all the time. Take away the eyes of the goaltender. What does that mean? It means you get yourself in front of that net, whether it's a double stack, a double screen, whatever you can do so that the goaltender can't find the puck. And he couldn't as he drops to that butterfly. He tries to make himself as big as possible, but he can't catch up to the puck. New York's got the lead here in the first as they have been the more dominant team in the offensive area. Dumps it into the ozone. Nice feed from the right wing. The Islanders play it along the wing. Poked away. The Kings have it against the wall. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Oh, big time hit along the wall. And this is why I'm glad I'm up here in a suit, Cheryl. And I'm right there with you, James. I wouldn't want to be along those boards either. It almost looked like he left his it's a bone crusher. Here's a shot. And he takes that one right in the midsection. More than half the frame has been played here. New York's ahead, 1-0. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. 
Back to the blue line. Good reach for the stick to knock the puck away. Can't maintain possession. Handles the puck. And that's intercepted by Paul Mary. Across the line from center. The center feed! Oh, he comes up with a stop. From the left wing, takes the feed. Here we go, pucks in deep. And that's poked away by Grunstrom. Quick feed to Ajo. Moves it to Pajo. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. The Islanders gain control of the puck. Picked up by Grunstrom. The Islanders get a hold of it. Fires it on net. Here's a shot. And there's a club save on the play. New York's capitalizing their offensive abilities here in this first period. Los Angeles has the puck here off the faceoff. Here's a short pass to Holtzman. Scores all over the rebound and tucks it in for the goal. Goal, James. He shows a knack for the net, being real hard and heavy on his stick as he's able to put that rebound in the net. Goaltender's got to clean that up, though. That one got kicked right back out. The Islanders extend the lead by two here in period number one. Well, I really like their play up to this point in the first period here, James. I mean, they've got themselves a two-goal cushion because they've been relentless on the puck. But now it's about continuing to be urgent, not getting complacent, and sitting back, continue to attack. Oh, just a textbook hit. Picked up along the wall by Roy. Now he slides it up to Deneau. Knocked away with the stick by Dobson. New York's on the attack. Moves it to the middle. And that goes off a stick and off target. Works it across to Dobson. Dropped him in the open ice. LA's got a hold of it against the wall. Shot blocked away by Sorokin. I love this save, James. I mean, the goaltender is so aggressive on this play. He doesn't give the shooter any time to get rid of it. Now a quick pass to Pellet. Trying to gain a step. He's in. All alone. What a stop on the breakaway. Tries to feed it over to Lee. Here they come on the attack down the right side. Here's a chance. And that doesn't reach the net. Slides the puck down low. Scooped up along the wall by Lee. Makes his presence known on the ice. Way too much congestion blocks that. Lowers the boom. Here in the later stages of this period, 2-0 is where we sit. Kopitar's won the faceoff, and now let's see what they can do. Came up with a nice save. Los Angeles has possession of the puck. Taken along the wall by Pulak. Down the left wing, they gain the zone. Slides the pass over to Anderson. From center, they get into the attacking area. Taken here by Fiala. That opportunity is rejected. Beautiful read in the defensive end by Pulak. 20 minutes in the books. Let's grab a breather and we'll come back with period number two in moments. Well, the first 20 is in the books. Let's see what this second period offers. Second frame is underway as the puck is dropped. Well, Cheryl, how do you sum this one up through the first 20 minutes? The Kings are going to need to find the details in their game here, James. They're not winning face-offs. They're not starting with the puck. And there's a real reason why they're behind. The Islanders move to the offensive zone. And that goes off course off a body. The Kings gain possession. Takes the pass. And lowers the boom with a 
big time hit. Wow, this is a message sending hit, isn't it? When you get all of your opponent and you're able to separate the body from Puck, you know you've done your job. Message delivered. And that was read perfectly. What a play by Dobson. The Islanders take it along the wall. Here's a shot. in the body language. New York's putting on an offensive clinic, now up 3-0. Uh, how often do you dominate possession? You can't find the back of the net. Well, different story tonight. They're executing on their chances. The Islanders take possession after that neutral zone faceoff. Slides it diagonally to Dowdy. And that goes off a of body. and get across to make that save. New York's offense has come to play in a big way as they dominated both the shots and goal category. Los Angeles has it in their own end. Battle ensues for that loose puck along the boards. Gabrikov stick handling in his own zone. And he slides it quickly to Dubois. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Roy. With possession along the wall. Pass in front. And he denies that great opportunity there. The Islanders have been on fire offensively tonight, and they lead for good reason here in the second. And off the draw, they win possession. Feeds it to Holster. Quick pass to Pasho. Moves the puck along the half wall. And that's a great hands up in the defensive zone to force the turnover. New York's got control of the puck. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Look out! There's someone stepping up with some physicality. I like this, James. You're almost out of the game, but you're finding a way to claw yourself back physically. And no better way to send a message than lay a huge one. Here's a shot. Oh, how did he get a glove on them? What a by Sorokin. Still lots of time left here in this frame. The Islanders are in cruise control, leading it 3-0. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Picked away in the offensive end. I'm not sure where the defense is, but I'll tell you what, the goaltender has been outstanding, made a flurry of saves to keep his team in this one. Nelson's taking it from his own end. Right side set up ahead into the middle of the ice. He scores! Jumps on the rebound and buries it! That's what you call taking advantage of a fortuitous rebound, and you have to be able to smell it and sniff it out because he has great hand-eye coordination be able to pick that one up and put it in the back of the net. New York's added yet another to extend this lead, and they are just flying tonight here in period number two. And they've completely worn their opponent down, so they have no energy to get to the puck or try and create. And this is a testament to their whole lineup. They came ready to play. Rocks them into the boards. Takes a shot. And the lane's clogged up, blocking that. Sends the pass over. With all kinds of traffic, he grabs the puck here inside his own end. Lee's going to play it against the half wall. That's some smart heads-up defensive play by Kipping. Excellent stick work on the play. Puck goes out of play. We got a face-off coming up. More than half the period has expired. 
The Islanders have added to their lead. They're now up by four. New York's won the faceoff at center. Along the half wall with the puck. Moves it quickly over. Oh, what a save! He stopped it! Wow! Oh, that's an intangible effort that you can't teach, James. That's all about desperation and the will to stop that puck. Play set to resume with the faceoff ready to go. Sizikas wins the faceoff in the offensive zone. Blocked in traffic. Puck scooped up by Kaliev. I don't think anybody was hanging onto the puck after that hit. There's a jolt of energy that he all alone makes the save. Oh, and this is a great save. You can see this one-on-one -on -one battle, and the goaltender is so dialed in, tracking, and makes that save. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Dishes it to Sizikas. Quick feed to pull off. Sends a pass over. And the puck leaves the zone. Los Angeles takes possession at center. Here's a shot. Oh, the poke check. What a read by the goaltender. Sends it in deep. LA's gained possession along the boards. Angles it over to Moore. Grabs control of it at the point. Moves it to Arvidsson. Scores! And that deflects in past the keeper. Wait a second here, James. This has been waved off on the ice. We'll have to see if this is going to be a rule, the kicking motion. The official waves off this goal initially, but they want to make sure that they get it 100% correct. can't get so it comes back to them it's a good goal and this is the momentum for the away team puck picked up by Romanov and now he moves it to Marcel LA's got the puck along the boards takes a shot oh what a paddle save on the play the Islanders cross the blue line and are on the attack quick feed down low here's a short pass to Nelson Pulak's got the puck along the blue line. Slick feed. Moves into the slot. Oh, denies him with the paddle save. This is a fantastic save, James. He's all over it. What I mean by that is he knows exactly where it is and where it's moving. A reason why he can get square to it and make the save. Here in the late goings of the period, Los Angeles has been overwhelmed in this one, down by three goals. The Kings win the draw on their own end. Kempe's got it through the neutral zone. Offside the call, we'll get a reset. Pop ready to drop here any moment to get things underway again. Kopitar's quick stick lands from the puck here at center. The Islanders gain possession in their own end. And he takes the pass. New York's got the puck against the boards. Shot! Scores! We'll talk about a friendly peak right there. Oh uh, yeah, it's all about the bounces, isn't it, James? And you gotta get the right one, and that one is in his favor. Man, he just exudes confidence on this shot. It's like he knows to make its way through the net with all that traffic in front. It's all about opening up your own lane and then waiting for that screen to take away the eyes of the goaltender. The Islanders continue to hammer the accelerator here in the late stage of period number two. It's been attack, attack, attack all night long. Yeah, they had the puck on their stick. They've driven the net when they've had the opportunity. And I mean, they just played well. They've been dominant tonight, James. The Kings cross the line and gain the zone. Yeah, James, I mean, they're 
continuing to acknowledge the save he made earlier because they know the temperature of this game. And hey, the fans are now in it. They're all on board. And guess what? The goaltender knows it. Oh, wow! Devastating hit. Big save just as time runs out. 40 minutes down. Still another 20 to go here in this one. Join us for period number three next. Responsible. LA's won the draw. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Scrum along the wall. Nice poke check. Hammers a shot. Denies him. Quick pass to Nelson. He carries the puck up along the wing. Taken by Barzell. The score! to get tight to the net here and it's all about accuracy and a quick release it's not about how hard it is and he doesn't miss new york's offense continues to shine here in this third period well this has got to be a dream for a coach you know that they're telling their team in the intermission to make sure they stay to business stay to task stay focused and that's exactly what they've done and they just hammered their opponent the islanders take possession here in the open ice Musa quickly over to thompson stones him in front Reaction time is so critical for goaltenders because the way the players shoot in this game today, man, it is so tough to stop. So this one, instincts. Blood goes up, makes the save. Moments away from the faceoff. Let's get back to the action. Nice job tying up his opponent. And he loses control of the puck. Grabbed along the boards by Arvidsson. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. Moves it to the middle! New York's got it in their own zone. Moves the puck. And that caroms off a body in the lane. Big hit, and that frees up possession. Puck sent over to Horvath. Takes a shot. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Riddick's been off his game tonight, really looking uncomfortable between the pipes, and he needs to settle in and find a way to create some momentum for his team. But on the other side of the puck, I mean, the forwards have to contribute offensively, and they can only do that if there's a sense of urgency to their game. Dumps it in. Los Angeles takes possession along the wall. Tremendous hit on the play, and that opens up some space. Power forward can be so difficult to contain. Why? Because you can hear them coming, James. They have the ability to deliver bone-crushing hits. And he takes the feed. Slides it over to Hoba. And he takes the feed. Oh, he'll feel that one. Throws it in. New York's got a hold of the puck now. Slides the puck to pull up. Quick feed to Engvall. Moves it over to Deneau. Backtracks with possession back inside the defensive zone. Gabrikov's got it along the wing. And that's a great heads-up play by Aho. Hugs the boards through the neutral zone. Receives the pass. Fiala's the pure goal scorer, but he just scores! All over the rebound, and he puts it in. a tougher play than it looks, James. You have to have timing and an awareness to be able to get your stick on that rebound and then bury it. Not a lot of time and space available, but he executes perfectly. 
The Kings are showing a little pride here in the third. And really, that's all that it's about right now. This game is over, and you can see they just want this game and the clock to tick down. They want that final buzzer to go. Kopitar's won the draw. And now he tries to get it across to Fiala. And he takes the dish. Scores on the rebound. It's buried. Well, such a fluid motion as he's skating in full stride and pulls that puck in towards his feet, changes the angle, and puts it by the goaltender. I don't think the goaltender even knew where that was going. Los Angeles has to continue to press and attack here in period number three. That was a nice play there to convert on that goal, but they need the other lines to get going, the other D pairings as well, to jump into the attack. They need just a whack load of goals here if they want to even have an opportunity at winning this game. New York's got the puck along the wall. Scores! And look who's at it again. Well, it's the second of the game. Too bad you can't bottle these games up and just recall them whenever you want because he's been all around the net. Well, when you're in tight to the net, you don't have much margin of error here. And he's able to find the back of the net. It's all about accuracy, not necessarily how hard the shot is. The Islanders probably don't want this game to end the way things have gone here. I know we're in period number three, but Cheryl, what a night. Yeah, it's been terrific right from puck drop, and they've been consistent throughout the game, and consistency is always a word that coaches talk about. And if they can finish this off with this nice lead, that's the word the coach is going to be preaching after the game. Riddick's going to hang on for a whistle. Oh. Officials ready to drop the puck and get things back underway. Start with the puck in the road end. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. And we'll get a face-off after the offside call. The Kings get a hold of the draw. Los Angeles plays it against the boards. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. And he was right there to make the stop on that play. I've never been a goaltender except in road hockey, James. But I tell you, if you take one off the mask, you got to be rattling. But nonetheless, he finds a way to get the save. And that's what you got to do. Put everything in front of it if you want to make the stop. Broken up by Nelson. New York's got the puck in the defensive end. Great on-ice vision to bat that down. New York's got possession here in the neutral zone. And some textbook body contact there. into the corner of the attacking area. Moves it to Lewis. Stops him with the glove! New York's gonna start with the puck in their own end. Here's a short pass to Martin. And he's pulled over to the ice and loses the puck. Quick shot! Big time save! Oh my goodness! Well, throw technique out the window. This time it's all about the competitive will to get to that puck. Riddick's in such great position. He's able to redirect that puck to safety right to the corner. Here's a shot. And he catches that one with the glove. Some last second communication with the D as centers get ready to drop the puck. And sneaks in and grabs possession. Scores! And they get one back here. I guess it's something to look at positively, James. I mean, the goal scorer certainly is going to feel happy that they've contributed, but they're going to have to find a way to dig themselves out of this hole, and it's a large one at that. They're going to put their work boots on and try and kick it into high gear if they even want an opportunity to claw their way back in this game. LA's recognized that they're not going to play run time here, so at least try to make it respectable. Respectable, and they can finish with physicality, and that's something that the staff will be telling them. Also look for everyone to be jumping into the attack, trying to get some pressure on their opponent and get some much-needed goals. The Islanders have it now. Sent into the offensive zone. Doughty 
he's got it through center. Centering feed! Oh, he comes up with a stop. Quick pass to Byfield. Turns another aside. New York's got to be impressed with this game tonight. Certainly their coaching staff anyways. It looks like their team has bought in, trust the process, and finding a way to get it done. Just look at the scoreboard, James. They're doing everything they can to get those numbers higher. The Islanders play it along the boards. And it's a quick pass to Byfield. Feeds the puck over to Kellyanne. Rocks him. Moves it quickly over to Byfield. Stop that one. Battle along the wall. And he's ridden off the puck. New York's got it behind the net. Takes the feed. The Islanders looking against the half wall. Holmstrom's looking to make something happen here in the corner. Denies him! He got all of it! Face-off coming up as the puck goes up and over the glass. Los Angeles desperate for some offensive conversions here late in this third period. And they win the offensive side face-off. Now let's see if they can capitalize. Looking to set up offensively. Out of midair, he swats it down to the ice. Feeds it over to Pajo. Passes out front. What a chance, but that goes off target off a of body in front. Kempe's loving the puck. Quick pass across to Fiala. Handles the pass. Take the way and forces the turnover at center. Charge it to the crease.